Okay. Hi, Priscilla. Hi, Monica. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me share my screen. Um, okay. So we have uh, most of you guys already connected. Um, so, so for this session, actually, I wanted um, everyone uh, to kind of like take attendance because I am one person alone and to go live and I want to take attendance. It's, it's, it would be hectic for me. Tapi, uh, I appreciate if you guys, you know, like just uh, type on the chat because this session is recording and I'm going to look back at the chat and see who attended the meeting and hopefully by the end of the program we will have a special award for people Hi. Uh, people who have who have more attendance so uh, and also your member ID Okay. Okay. Hi, Aisha. So I will meet everyone. Okay. So uh, we are recorded and then. Let me go to the slide. Okay, so you guys boleh nampak my screen? Boleh, boleh nampak. Okay. So before um, we start, okay, if anyone wants to uh, switch on your video, feel free to do so because I feel like if I can see your face, I would be more excited and I would be have I would be more you know. Lagi semangat untuk share about our M Oil Academy because I'm able to see your face. Okay, so um, yeah, yeah. Hi Mal, hi April, hi Monica. Good job. Alright, so it's feel so good to see you guys. Uh, sebab Raya ni memang ah, uh, kat rumah je kan macam tak boleh nak keluar. And then you know, we try to visit our friends dekat Penang, tapi macam roadblock. So Cannot. So um, I, I've only seen my family faces, my husband, my kids, my neighbor pun I tak tengok muka orang sebab semua orang dalam rumah. So it's a bit craving for that human touch right now. <laughs> okay, so um, welcome to our first ever virtual meetup for M Oiler Academy participants. Thank you so much for showing up. Uh, I know it's not easy for some of you because maybe in, in your background, you have kids running around and maybe you are um, busy working, you have to overtime or something. So I really appreciate your time. Um, I promise this will be a quick one. Okay, uh, so, uh, it's just that sebelum kita officially start tomorrow, I think I need have I need to have this session uh, untuk semua orang uh, nampak like what are we going to do for the next 90 days. And then how does this actually help to add value to your business? Okay, so um, M Oil Academy is uh, is a 90 days. Well, I would not say 90 days, lah, so Bob, we started mid of the month. So, and then we'll be end, ending this program at the end of July. So, mungkin dalam masa uh, 70 hari macam tu kan. So, um, actually this is a program that I have um, I, I, I was inspired to have this program for, our, for my team because, um, oh my god, my nani is okay, because um, last few months, okay, I have participated uh, a program uh, hosted by Jill On Call. Uh, if you guys start kenal Jill On Call too, she is the owner of the Grow Group, okay. The Grow Group is a Facebook group. Okay, you can search in Facebook Grow. It is a group uh, hosted by Jill On Call and open to all business builders of Young Living. Tidak kisah which team you are, which sidelines or cross lines you are, doesn't matter. But the intention is to help Young Living business builders 
to grow their business. And um, all the value, you know, the value of that group is very, very um, precious because everyone like stepping in untuk bagi idea, untuk share their experience, untuk bagi testimonials, share their posters, share their whatever things that they have been doing to grow their business. Um, that is a community where everybody get to share something from them from from their side lah. Okay, so um, I joined and and she hosted this program called Becoming Unstoppable. So Becoming Unstoppable is also a ninety days program. Okay, sekejap eh. uh, I have to mute sekejap. So back to just now. So um, the Becoming Unstoppable is actually a, also a 90 days program uh, that Jill will come and, you know, bagi tas every day, akan bagi tas. Lepas tu dia akan uh, go on Facebook Live and talk about uh, some business topics like enrollments, um, giving her wisdom in this business and things like that. So it's a 90 days program and I commit myself to that. So I found like after a uh, joint program too, I rasa macam, oh man, if only I knew about this program when I was senior star, when I was executive, I think I would have, I could have done more in, in, my, in my business. Because sometimes when we are building, when, when we are star, when we are, you know, distributor to executive, sometimes we feel stuck. And we, we see a stagnant in our business, macam, Dah berapa bulan share, we, we do social media, we do videos, we follow up, but we are still there. Like we are not going anywhere, but we're still there, right? See, uh, so when I joined that program, I nampak, wow, there are so many things that I haven't tried before. So um, I wish I would, I wish I was in that program when I was uh, executive so that I knew I can do more, I can try more things lah. Right. So most of the things, most of the uh, the ideas, yang you, I'm not sure whether you guys already look at the Facebook group. Uh, the guide guides too. I dah letak a few a few things that I want you guys to start to doing next month at uh, next week. So those are the things that I actually taken from that program lah. Uh, but of course, not everything is from there. About uh, orang putih punya culture and kita as Asian punya culture is a, a bit different. Orang tu more like personal branding, like. Don't just talk about oils, talk about yourself, talk about your family, talk about your dog, talk about your husband, like your personal branding. Tapi in, in our culture, we, we have to kind of balance that. About if you keep talking about yourself, nobody, is know, nobody will know that you are young living distributors. So we have to balance on that. So I mainly I took all the, um, some of the ideas I dapat dari situ and I incorporate to our academy uh, based on, I think, apa yang kita perlukan lah, okay? So, um, this is a program to help every one of us here to step up um, to become a leader in your team and also to help to build a habits, okay? Sebab so, kadang-kadang, um, we only focus on sharing, but we don't, um, memang sharing is the key in the business, but at the same time, we also kena belajar how to do follow up, how to do closing, um, how to connect with others, how to expand our network, how to engage with people yang um, bukan our, our team yet, you know, those kind of things. Those are skills that we have to learn juga. Kan? We cannot rely on um, sharing posts in social media, but also we have to get out and meet people sometimes. Kan? So um, before we go into the details, so I want to start talking about rewards first because at the end of the program, this is what you guys are going to nail. Okay, so uh, Dreamcatcher Challenge is not by M. Euler team, yeah? it's by Zero Euler. So kalau anyone here belum tahu lagi susu galur kita as a team is, uh, M. Euler is under Zero Euler, okay, directly under Zero Euler. Dila is my enroller. 
So uh, this is hosted and organized by Dila. And Dreamcatcher Challenge adalah buka terbuka kepada business builder yang registered sahaja. Maksudnya siapa yang dah register tu, yes, you guys will have the chances to earn this free oils. But if you miss it out, if you tak sempat nak register, so you are not able to get this lah. Okay, so I believe some of you guys here dah register macam um, a few of you kan. A few of you dah register uh, and at the end of this is a two months thing kan sampai bulan Jun. So you have this, okay? You have this at the end of the road and then on the road you have this M Oiler Academy which is going to help you um, to grow inshallah. And um, hopefully you guys, siapa-siapa yang ada hantai nama tu dapat score 40 points lah because I think um, I think these are the oils that you can get. It's good to have lah. Tapi I think paling rewarding punya gift tu is the top 10 virtual retreat. Eh, not virtual. Uh, top 10. Siapa yang dapat top 10 uh, winners tu boleh attend free retreat sponsored by Dila. Okay. So that retreat is uh, 10 orang daripada winners of Dream Catcher Challenge ni akan dapat uh, pergi satu tempat which I don't know yet sebab sekarang masih COVID and Dila pun tak confirm lagi. Uh, 10 of all of us Okay, we'll go to this retreat and there will be um, swag items. Dia macam seolah-olah macam kita pergi silver retreat. Cumanya lokasi dia dekat Malaysia lah, kan? So I think that is something that is more valuable because you don't get to simply get that by... Uh, you need to earn that opportunity, kan? Oils ni kita boleh beli at least. Tapi that retreat is not something that you can buy. You have to personally experience it yourself, okay? So for 20 points, you get Envision, 30 points, you get Envision plus Gratitude, Awaken, uh, and 40 points, you will get another Humility. So semua oils ni adalah daripada US, it's not in Malaysia, all right? So, um, and the next reward from our own team, M Oiler, uh, M Oiler team, uh, which is the new rank cups. So if you are currently a distributor, you tak pernah rank up lagi and you rank up to star uh, bulan ni ataupun bulan uh, Jun or July and maintain one month which is dua bulan you stay, you maintain as star lah. So you can get uh, an essential oil and also a mug, a mug uh, by Amp Oiler, okay. Um, only for Amp Oiler will get, only for Amp Oiler will get the will get the will get the, the special mark okay i'm very excited for the mark because i think this is the first ever amp oiler uh selain daripada sticker yang korang nampak live like eo tu kan uh, this is like the first item that i am doing for our team lah so i'm very excited for that so if you are star previously and you rank up to senior star and you maintain sebulan okay you are going to dua oil and a mark and then if you rank up to executive and maintain another month of executive um, pada bila-bila bulan uh, bulan Mei atau Jun or July ni okay then you get a bag okay this bag is young living bag you can only get this from the YL gear uh, so uh, and if you are going for silver okay and maintain dua bulan why dua bulan sebab it's going to help you to maintain your silver retreat punya opportunities. So if you guys don't know, kalau kita dah hit silver, silver is 10,000 OGV. Okay, so I know some of you guys tak familiar lagi apa tu OGV, apa tu PV, apa tu rank, apa tu legs. It's okay sebab uh, dalam academy uh, program ni, I will also talk about that lah uh, sometime next week. So 10,000 is the OGV untuk silver and you ada syarat kaki juga. So kalau you maintain lagi dua bulan selama which means you get you hit silver three months berturut-turut, you akan dapat pergi visit Mona Utah Farm dekat USA. Alright. Um, so that is why I put here two months so that uh, it's kind of like forcing you to maintain uh, your silver uh, for 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 the entire three months where you dapat. Uh, sekaligus dapat the rewards and also the retreat lah, right? So, um, that is for the rank cups and the, the next uh, reward is the top three enrollers. 
Um, top two enrollers uh, will also be rewarded with a special rare item from NFR market. NFR maksudnya not for resale, uh, which means our NFR market is US. Okay, US. Apa-apa yang kita order daripada US tu, itu sebenarnya adalah NFR items yang tidak ada dalam Malaysia. So, we as member, we can actually order that. Kan? Tapi lecehnya kita kena kalau kita order from Young Living website tu, we have to pay for the tax, we have to pay for the expensive delivery fees. So um, that's why sometimes occasionally you akan nampak I buka US order dekat our group tu to help to you know kind of like um, arrange all these tax ataupun uh, uh, ordering and then shipping semua tu. Okay, so top three highest uh, top three enrollers akan dapat special rare item from uh, NFR market and this is the number of uh, total tiga bulan punya enrollments okay contohnya kalau bulan Mei you enroll lima orang bulan Jun you enroll dua orang bulan Julai you enroll sepuluh orang so tambah number tu and siapa yang dapat paling tinggi the top three will get um, the reward lah alright okay so that was about the reward and oh so sweet Zah. <laughs> multitask kita eh okay so how does it work so now we go into the details lah right so how does this academy work um so the first thing is um find accountability partners so why i emphasize on this and i kind of like force you guys to find your group semalam kan satu hari terus settle alhamdulillah because um, when I was, um, just this is something that I just want to share with you lah. When I was uh, star, senior star executive, I did not have accountability partners. Um, I basically just say, okay, Dila cakap ni, uh, ada leader share macam ni, oh, kita just buat je. Kita just macam, okay lah, buat, buat, go with the flow lah, kind of like go with the flow. And when there are bumps and ataupun blockage ataupun um, roadblocks, I have only one person to share, which is Dila, my enroller, right? So, um, but uh, last year, 2020, last year, uh, around, I think around um, March like that, I started to have accountability partners, uh, which also inspired by the Becoming Unstoppable punya group tu. I found my accountability partners, which is Kak Fi, Firel Faru, if you guys know, and also Nadia. Nadia is in Penang. So we get to meet up sometimes and then we talk about business. We um, share our dilemmas, our struggles. So bila ada, buat, bila ada accountability partners too, it's like you are having uh, sisters standing beside you, like if you're feeling down, okay, this one will be like, okay, it's okay, you can do this, you know, they will give a lot of positive words and then if you are feeling wow i did this and i feel so so apa, so satisfied because my i finally see results from whatever i'm planning to do and then i share it with them they also get benefit from that they also get to learn something from my sharing so um having accountability partners will have will make a huge change if you use it correctly if you betul -betul gunakan, um, the benefits of having these people around you and you guys can grow each other can motivate each other can you know masing masing boleh inspire each other in many ways right and i know you guys mungkin tak kenal lagi um tak kenal lagi so that's why um we are meeting every week every saturday um just one hour session and by the end of the meeting too we will go into breakout rooms for us to masing-masing uh, dalam masuk dalam group accountability masing-masing and share start talking start sharing start say whatever things that you want to share with your team your struggles your wins your ideas your whatever things that came across to your mind okay so that is the role of accountability partners so that bila kita rasa wah macam too many, I'm overwhelmed, I'm so tired, I feel like I don't want to do this anymore. And then there will be people come in and say, it's okay. You know you want to do this. This is not you. This is just your emotional talking. Just use your oils, use your oils, use your oils. There will be people that can remind you, okay, um, you need to go rest for a while and then come back. 
things like that. Daripada kita seorang and kita just layan perasaan and kita terus tak nak buat kan. So that is also the, um, that is why I wanted everyone to have a, a group of accountability partners. Secondly is do the weekly tasks. So dalam master's panjang program ni, there will be weekly tasks and actually it's already being streamed down. So it's not like macam program um, geo on call tu, it's daily tasks. Every day ada task kena buat. Uh, I think Aisha sign up for the uh, the Unstoppable Academy kan? It's really a lot of tasks. Every day ada tasks. I pun macam rasa tak boleh nak buat semua because it's a bit overwhelming for me. So I break this into a weekly task and um, task tu cuma ada sembilan task je. Sembilan task for you to do in seven days. So it's more bearable, it's more um, acceptable, it's not really taking so much of your time. You just have to set a time and do it, done. Set a time, do it, done. Okay. Thirdly is participate intentionally. Um, this program is not just, uh, you know, commit, right, uh, register yourself, commit, and that's it. It needs your participation. You need to do it intentionally with an intention to really want to grow, to really want to see how far you can go in this business. Okay, so mungkin selama ni kita just um, share, we have our plan like, okay, maybe Monday, Tuesday, I want to do um, social media, I want to do videos, and then Wednesday, I want to do coaching, I want to do follow up. We, or I believe everyone here already have your own style ataupun your own um, cara untuk grow your business. And, um, but... Uh, but this program, uh, there are some tasks that you need to do and you just have to, okay, I have to do this. Okay, I slot it into my schedule, whatever already things that you already have planned. Okay, this task, okay, I will do this on this day. This task, I will do this on that day. So you, you get to, you know, plan your own schedule and then just make sure at the end of the week, you've done all the tasks, okay? Okay, all right. So for the accountability groups, I'm going to skip. Kejap. So for the accountability groups, um, this one um, kita dah discuss lah. Okay. Okay, so for this is a master plan monthly tracker. So this one pun I dah share dalam our Facebook group. Uh, nanti kita akan um, kind of like go through. Huh? No, 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 just this one. No, I'm meeting now, sayang. So, um, I've already shared this in our Facebook group. So, this is uh, every month you can see, see this tracker lah. Okay, so let me go through what is this tracker about. This is a master plan money tracker for bulan May. Okay, nanti akan ada untuk bulan Jun, untuk bulan Julai. So, uh, and now it's already 16 of the month, tapi it's okay. Um, just fill in the numbers, the expectations according to your, according to your, apa? Your acceptance lah. Please, 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 please. Okay. So the first one here adalah um, the numbers. Okay, what is your expected OGV of the month? Uh, contohnya bulan Mei ni mungkin you tengok your OGV now um, and then you think of how how much you can do because now it's already mid of the month and I understand mungkin awal bulan tu you dah ada buat goal sendiri. Okay, katakan you nak maintain star 500 tapi sekarang ni baru 100. So dalam masa 15 hari ni, is it doable 500? Yes, it's doable. So, you have to set a number. Janganlah number yang sama je. You have to set a number yang akan membantu you meningkatkan your OGV. So, mungkin you double up to 1,000. So, bila you double up to 1,000, at least apa yang you buat and you are planning that ideas subconsciously that you are heading for growth, not just stagnant. Okay? So, OGV, what is your... Uh, target OGV of the month and how many personal involvements you want to have, how many PSK you want to sign up, how many new members you want to have in your team. Okay, so that will depending on 
apakah OGV yang you nak target? So if let's say you are 100, you only did, you baru buat ER and you want to get 500, you want to hit star this month. So I have another 400 OGV remaining. So 400 is equivalent to 4 PSK. So 4 PSK, you put that number there. Ini kalau contoh you tak ada siapa-siapa lah in your team. Uh, you tak pernah enroll lagi. So you put four enrollments, uh, in four personal enrollments and then four new members. So lepas tu, bila you dah nampak, okay, bulan ni you ada target, you know where are you heading, you know you need to find four enrollments. So whatever you do tu, whatever you are sharing, whatever you do for your business, it has to um, heading towards that goal lah. Okay. So what is the income? So income is subjective, okay? Sometimes you would want to put um, 1,000, 2,000, or you want to just get a free ER, so up to you. But as long as, yeah. Okay, so uh, income ni, um, uh, you have to write down the income. Sebab kalau you tak write down income, because semua orang kat sini, uh, you are doing this business because you want more income kan? Uh, you want to get more money, you want to get zero cost ER. So you have to talk about income. You have to think of berapa banyak duit yang you nak dapat daripada YL ni. That's why dalam Google form tu, yang mana korang register, I ask you guys to fill in what is your income uh, that you expect to have three to five years kan? Ada yang tulis 500,000, ada yang tulis 2,000, ada yang tulis um, 4,000, ada yang tulis executive. So, um, uh, based on your ideal income too, mungkin you have to you have to start thinking like, okay, if my income in three years time, I want to have 50K, 50K is about what? Gold um, or platinum. So starting from now, what is my expected income every month? Kan? So you have to sit down, have your coffee beside you or tea, a paper, a pen and start writing. Okay, three years after this is where I'm going to be. So you break it down to few chunks and then see, okay, at this at this quarter of time, berapa banyak income yang I nak? At this quarter of time, berapa increment yang I nak? Semua tu. So um, just start somewhere. Okay, you don't have to be precisely lah. Tak perlu pun rasa macam kena tepat, kena kena rasa macam bila you tulis pun you rasa macam eh betul ke ni? Rasa macam tak mungkin je. But it's okay. We all have to dream. We all have to angan-angan sekejap and envision that because when you envision things, things will start to happen slowly. Kan? Kalau kita envision and we put on hard work with persistence, then you will start to see where you are heading there. So income and what's your rank? Okay, um, and then the campaign. So master plan ni, you korang boleh um, print out. Okay, if you don't like to print out, you like to tulis tangan pun tak apa. As long as you have somewhere, you you can like if you want to write down in your books, in your uh, in your notebook kan, you can write it down and put somewhere that you can see every day. Supaya you reminded yourself about that. Okay, so for the campaign. Um, dekat sini, this is referring to um, four things that we should be doing every month. Contohnya, enrollment. Okay, enrollment, apakah campaign yang I nak buat for enrollment? So, let's say um, I want to do free, uh, I want to do welcome gift for new re newly enrolled members. So, I akan go to Shopee, I akan cari EORAC, I akan cari e diffuser bag. Uh, okay, these are the things. My budget is 50 ringgit. So these are the things that I want to do for enrollment campaign. So write that down. So when you write that down, you know that, okay, bulan ni I akan buat campaign ni. So I akan, bila I akan announce dekat social media and um, berapakah uh, limit yang I nak buat. Lepas tu, mid of the month, you remind lagi. Um, mungkin you boleh tulis dekat social media. Just share that. Okay, I have five welcome gifts and three of them are taken and then there's two more left. Um, then you talk about your, you know, uh, you kind of like attract people to um, rebut peluang to dapat welcome gift tu. Okay, so, or you can also um, plan something macam thank you gift card. 
thank you gift card to something like um, when when I okay when you enroll someone okay you you bagi thank you gift card so gift card tu dia boleh guna on the next purchase kalau dia buat 100 PV ke atas contohnya you bagi 100 ringgit 100 ringgit is about kita boleh bagi hadiah um, maximum 100 ringgit saja um, but not from YL products okay so kita boleh bagi 100 ringgit gift card so gift card tu you boleh lah buat dekat Canva um, hari tu I ada send kan uh, sample dekat telegroup tu you can make your own, customize a bit, put on your favorite picture or your favorite um, your favorite graphics and then your names and then customize some personal message and then um, mention that this gift card is to be used for next purchase, uh, things like that. Benda yang you boleh attract people untuk sign up. Okay, create that urgency juga. And for zero PV, okay, I understand Mungkin some of your team, uh, some of you guys punya team dah ada 10 orang, 15 orang. Tapi none of them buat ER. None of them um, buat pembelian. So a lot of zero PV members. Every month geram tau tengok zero, 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 zero. <laughs> macam tu kan. Rasa macam oh man. So what can we do for these people is kita boleh bagi happy mail. Happy mail means that, um, contoh lah. Okay. Contoh hari ni, I nak contact five members from my team yang dah zero PV lama. Uh, dah berapa bulan dia tak buat pembelian. So, I will uh, save their contact number and I will connect with them and I will um, offer them, um, I would like to send you a happy mail. So, yang ini, yang ini contoh ya. I tak pernah cuba lagi tapi yang I pernah cuba is I just bagi je. I tak bagi pilihan. But this is uh, something like you bagi pilih Okay, kalau dia sebab orang yang you tak kenal ni, you memang tak tahu dia minat apa kan. Mungkin orang yang in, orang your downline yang enroll dia, so you tak kenal tapi you just want to catch up with them. So, you after you build rapport, you connect with them and then you can offer, hey, I would love to give you some happy mail. Um, uh, I made some, you know, I made some... Um, happy meal samples that I want to give it to you. So you can choose which one you want. Okay, first mungkin you boleh buat contoh eh. You boleh buat um, sample of ceiling comes lotion ataupun some 2 ml sample oils with a, with a gift, uh, with a graphic card, graphic card, with a card yang macam ada diffuser blend. You can just print it out with your printer. Okay, tak perlu perfect sangat pun. It's just something that sincerely from you, kan? You nak bagi orang, so you jangan fikir macam, alah tak pelah kecil dia ni. No, don't, don't think like that. So sometimes people really appreciate apa yang kita buat tu, people akan rasa siapa nak bagi kan, dapat free kan. Uh, so you can try things like that. Ataupun kalau you ada budget concern, you feel like you tak ada macam banyak masa, okay, masa you kena prepare nak buat sample, nak buat ni kan. So if you have no time to do it, just fix to one sample contohnya, thieves cleaner. So beli a plastic bottle, you know, the plastic bottle yang boleh isi thieves cleaner and then print out a thieves cleaner punya um, 10 types of recipes and then put it into a card ataupun package it and send it to them. So use it, benda ni macam an investment lah. Kalau kita buka booth pun, kita kena bayar booth punya sewa and kita kena bawa barang. So our investment is on the booth punya sewa and also our barang nak bagi sample tu kan. So sekarang ni since we are not allowed to go out, buka booth, jumpa orang. So we do whatever things that we can. Okay, so this is how I, um, sometimes I will use this way, kalau I ada masa, <laughs> I akan hantar happy mail lah dekat my um, team yang, dekat members yang dah lama tak beli. Okay, so pernah juga bila diorang dapat tu and then the next month diorang nak purchase, tapi walaupun diorang tak buat ER, but at least they purchase 50 PV. So um, it can be something that you can, you can try lah, okay. Um, ataupun if you tak ada masa nak buat, just bagi free shipping. Kalau you buat 50 PV, dapat free shipping. Okay. So ini idea dia lah. And then for essential rewards ni, um, okay. So essential rewards ni, um, it's kind of a heavy topic for some people. Sebab bukan semua orang boleh afford to spend um, 500 ringgit, uh, 400 ringgit a month kan. So um, think of it like for people who are already on essential rewards, 
okay we want to find ways to help them to share about young living meaning that we have to find ways to convert them become a business builder so um, what can we do is you can encourage them to share the social media and offer incentive uh, contohnya macam kalau you share about your experience what is your favorite oil what how do you diffuse uh, how do you use your oils what do you see and then i'll give you a free something something okay you can do like that um and when people who are not on essential rewards how you can encourage them is contohnya um, sekarang ni uh, orang tak pernah buat ER lagi so you want to encourage them so how about i offer you uh, free shipping for the first time when you do your first uh, first time ER. How about I offer you a free gift ataupun a free um, something something um, if you place your first ER order. So um, so you can try out those kind of things, um, see whichever that works for you. Uh, and the last one, invite them to be interviewed by you about their YL journey on Facebook Live. So this is also an opportunity yang you boleh, um, who knows you might get a business builder from, from by interviewing people kan. Uh, I tried this actually, I tried this with one of my uh, personally in law members. She was on, she was not on ER, I think. She was not on ER. Lepas tu, I say, okay, can I interview? Sebab dia dah pernah share dia punya testimonials dekat support group. So I say, hey, Sanian, can I, uh, can, I'm doing this um, weekly talk show. I call it talk show uh, that I would like to invite you to share your testimonials. And I'll ask a few questions and then you just jawab je. Okay, boleh? Okay, so, um, and then she, after the talk show, she was really enjoyed. So they tak pernah buat live. That's the first thing. They tak pernah, uh, they tak pernah show her face on Instagram. So uh, that experience, macam bantu dia rasa best lah. Dia rasa seronok. Dia rasa best. And then when you feel personally feel happy, kan? You feel happy. You feel excited. You want to do more. You want. You are excited. You want to know more. So. Um, she signed up on ER after that, after the after the next, the following month lah. So that can also be something fun and interesting and not so, you know, macam pushy. Sometimes kita rasa macam, alah nak cakap pasal ER, macam mana nak, nak cakap ni macam rasa berat mulut tu kan. So this can be something fun and interesting and it's not pushy. It's, it's just having fun whether or not she want to go on ER tak apa. But it's just something that you can build your relationship with your team. Okay, so um, as for business builder, okay, now you want to convert members into business builder. So some people yang tak pernah ER and tiba-tiba akan datang, hey, I want to do business. Sebab dia nampak you share business, kan. Some people, they have to be on a long period of ER barulah terbuka hati untuk buat business. So you have to like find them at the right place. Contohnya macam you tahu your friend, okay, the one that you have enrolled and you tahu dia tengah ada masalah kewangan, contoh. So, uh, asking her to be on ER, it you would feel macam rasa um, dilema juga kan, rasa macam uh, takpelah, kesian kat dia macam tu kan. So, what you can change the perspective is let her see how the young living business can help her right and then maybe at the first few months you have you can help her a little bit maybe you can help her to find some loose order you know things like that as a we, we want to help people sometimes it's hard for people to nampak um young living opportunity because they have not been in it tapi kita semua dah uh, mostly kita dah pernah enroll orang so kita nampak uh, kita dah pernah rasa dapat bonus tu macam mana kita dah dapat rasa dapat bantu orang tu macam mana so but most of them, they don't experience this yet. So our job, our calling, our responsibility is to help them, to guide them, to help them see um, what they can actually get, you know, by doing this and that. So invite to classes, um, offer one-on-one -on -one session, Zoom call to talk about um, compensation plan, um, 
uh, apa, help to teach them about how to follow up, how to do closing, um, how to promote, how to do posters, things like that. Okay, little things is matter. Jangan rasa macam um, uh, benda tu kecil je dia boleh belajar sendiri. Trust me, they will not. They will not belajar sendiri. <laughs> Sometimes you have to be the one yang buka topik tu. Uh, nanti bila dia dah nampak benda tu baru dia akan teruskan buat. Okay. Uh, Alright, so promo items. Okay, this one is more on like, okay, now we have PV promo. So PV promo tu uh, kita boleh um, use that as our topic to share dekat social media. Contohnya, we supposed to get grapefruit kan, tapi grapefruit dah habis. And then there's a, um, what is the 90, 990 PV promo eh? Lupa dah. Apa eh? Magnify your purpose ke? Bukan. 190 PV punya gift apa eh? Oh my god, tak ingat dah. Okay, contohlah. Cinnamon bar. Ah, uh, cinnamon bar. Ah, uh, thank you Bella. So, kalau cinnamon bar, okay, maybe you can start thinking of um, how to do um, apa EOF punya recipes with cinnamon bar. You can share that in in your with your builders supaya dia nampak kegunaan oils tu. Okay, um, share it with members. Uh, and don't expect people will read in the telegram group. Don't expect your builders, siapa-siapa yang you masukkan dalam group tu, mereka akan baca. Because some of them, they not, they don't read the group. They don't really, you know, uh, macam kita as business builder, we have that responsibility. Uh, awareness untuk tengok group tu. Tapi user yang tak aktif sangat, mereka tidak akan selalu tengok macam kita. So we, as their enrollers, we have to take that, you know, extra step to notify them, to let them know and kind of like drag them, pull them back to the, the Telegram group lah. Sebab Telegram ni, bukan semua orang akan rajin buka. Dia tak macam WhatsApp. WhatsApp ni, kalau uh, kita akan more kepada WhatsApp because we are used to it kan. Tapi for Telegram, it's a bit hard now sebab tak ramai orang lagi biasa dengan Telegram punya features, dia punya kebiasaan, you know that 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 vibes is not there yet. So uh, for now, whenever you put someone in that group, um, also note that um, during, I mean, don't expect them to read every single sentence dalam tu. Okay, uh, we have we still carry the responsible untuk notify them juga lah. If there's any promos, if there's any education uh, or tips yang you rasa during boleh ber, uh, boleh bantu during and you know like kind of like forward that to them lah. okay all right so checklist of the month okay this is the the very important okay uh, at the end of every month too um our goal is to get most of this checkbox tick right so first announce monthly ylpv promo Announce monthly team promos. Monthly team promos ni kan cakap kalau I ada buat um, you know pwp purchase with purchase kind of uh, promotion ke ataupun uh, lucky draw ke, you can let your team know about that. Okay, send rank gifts or cards kalau siapa-siapa yang rank up as star in your team, siapa yang first time enroll, siapa yang uh, enroll dua orang first time, you know, little things that you can celebrate, you can make it as a celebration with your team. Um, make sure all new members are in the member group and you have welcomed them. Uh, follow up dengan kita punya prospects, um, message you, you're you about to go in active members yang dah lama zero PV, yang dah almost expired tu, um, we can kind of like um, remind them that their account is expiring soon. So if you want to reactivate, it's going to cost you 100 PV. So better, react, better maintain your account now, okay, things like that. Um, schedule classes, personally invite your members yang you enroll and interested people make it quick and fun. Macam I cakap tadi tu kan, IG live, IG interview session, benda-benda macam tu pun boleh dijadikan sebagai um, something that you can initiate, okay, untuk buat kelas. Tak tak semestinya kena buat Zoom E0101, kena ada slide, tak semestinya macam tu. Jangan rasa, oh I have to do Zoom, I have to spend time to do slide, oh my god, I have to master this, I don't know how to explain about this. So, we don't have to wait until we are perfect, baru kita nak ajar, baru kita nak buat kelas. 
um, you can always go on IG live, click on that live and then start talking, start sharing. Okay, jangan rasa, jangan fikir banyak sangat. When you focus on your fear, you don't see what you are going to. I give you an, anal an analogy. Okay. If you are driving a car, you are driving a car on the road, can and then when there is a lorry in front of you, um, is coming towards you and doesn't seem to stop. Like she, the, the lorry macam dah, okay, dia dah, dia nak masuk your lane dah. So you will be the one who's like looking at the lorry and then not looking at somewhere else kan. Kita akan fokus kepada hazardous, uh, apa hazard dekat depan tu. Kita tak fokus sama mana yang kita nak pergi, mana yang kita boleh pergi. We will just focus on that lorry and sometimes, when we focus on that, we don't move. We just like, just stay there and just wait for things to happen, right? We focus on the fear. So, but um, this is what I, this morning I just listened to this sharing by uh, Tony Robbins lah. Dia bagi analogi yang sangat-sangat, sangat-sangat touch my heart because her, his, his analogy is like this. When you are focusing on the fear, you will go to there. You will just wait there and let it happen to you. Uh, apa? Uh, instead of taking steps to like run out from that, that, uh, that dangerous or that impact. So, but um, when you like move, like willing to look away, jangan tengok lori tu, but like move your sights away from the lorry and try to look for something else try to look for ways and things that can save your life from then mungkin you akan selamat betul tak so two things here if you focus on the lorry if you focus on the truck what is the possibility that you will not get hit zero because you focus on that you're not moving you just like stay there and wait for it to hit you but if you look away and you try to find other other ways or other solutions there is a possibility there is a possibility that you can still save your life betul tak um walaupun it doesn't guarantee you will be safe okay uh, na'uzubillah that walaupun it doesn't guarantee you will be safe tapi at least you have the the probability of getting safe, uh, being alive from the accident, okay? Okay, so, let's see this, let's see this, play this, play this, okay. So, um, oh my god, kejap, kejap, yeah, yeah, kejap. Okay, so um, apa ni? Okay, so let's continue uh, from the uh, flash business intro uh, classes for your download. Okay, so these are the things that you can do. Uh, so tak tak semua orang. I mean, this doesn't apply to everyone because mungkin you tak ada lagi business builders, mungkin you tak ada lagi anyone from your team kan. So you look at this list and you see whichever yang you boleh boleh buat. Okay, dalam sebulan tu, whichever things that you boleh buat. So, the goal is, at the end of the month, semua, uh, every one of us, you look at this list and you see many ticks. Okay? You tick most of the things on this list. Okay. So, daily habits. This is, um, basically, these are the things that kita akan buat selama tiga bulan ni lah. Okay? Um, first is social media planner. So this topic, I will cover it uh, sometime around next week or next two weeks um, because I think social media planner ni is benda yang you boleh um, improve, improvise. Uh, kalau sama ni, you memang duduk share. You share about diffuser blends, you share about YL, you share about yourself. But there are times mungkin um, by just, you know, um, balance it out. Uh, mungkin hari ni you boleh share tentang YL tips ke. Then next tomorrow you can share about oils for empowerment. Contoh lah kan. So maybe it, it can help you to boost up your um, your engagement juga. Sebab orang akan nampak, oh YL ni bukan oil saja kan. YL ni also about pets. YL is about family wellness. So things like that. 
Okay, so there will be topics and also uh, uh, guidelines on macam mana kita boleh um, kita boleh you know uh, make your social page social media page more interesting. Okay, and then um, accountability group. Okay, so group ni um, you guys can like make your own. You can do. I mean, this is flexible lah. So I'm not like saying you have to do a group. Uh, apa? A private uh, group, WhatsApp group, and then you guys have to talk about this. No, this is up to you. If you are comfortable to have your own little group and to talk about, you know, kind of like share ataupun discuss um, using that group as a discussion platform, feel free to do it. Okay, kalau tak, um, then every bi-weekly, setiap dua minggu sekali, kita akan meet dalam breakup session. So dalam Zoom, macam Zoom ni, but I will break you guys into your own accountability group. So dalam group tu, koranglah cerita masing-masing um, your own, you know, your your sharings, your struggles, your wins and so on. And what are the ideas, if you nak minta pendapat, that is where you talk about, um, you 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 listen and share about your ni lah, your ideas kan. So Saturday weekly virtual meet up. So, um, I am hoping that we can meet every Saturday, um, just one hour of your time, just one hour. But I haven't decided what time is the best. About ada yang mungkin Saturday morning nak pergi church, ada yang mungkin um, Sunday morning ada commitment kan. So later I will need you guys to vote whatever, whichever time yang paling sesuai, uh, so that everyone can make it. Uh, lepas tu, every week, not every week lah. I mean. Um, some weeks I akan invite guest speaker. Uh, contohnya macam I akan invite our uh, Onyang, Onyang, Dila, Dila that uh, untuk share uh, a few topics, and I will also invite my accountability partners, uh, Kafi, to share a bit. So um, guest speaker lah basically. Okay, so um, Monday wisdom, fifteen minutes on Facebook. Okay, this is my job, my commitment and my promise to you uh, to bring value to your uh, 90 days program with Academy. So this is my commitment. I know I have to show up every Monday on Facebook Live. I know I have to talk about a topic that I already um, set up. So that is my commitment. Okay, macam mana pun I have to show up, I have to um, talk about, uh, execute the plan that I, I have already planned. So because I know sometimes bila kita dah plan plan plan, tapi macam kita uh, off track and then we're like, ah kejap anak menangis lah, kejap anak nak pergi ni lah, kejap nak pergi keluar beli groceries lah, and then end up kita tak buat apa apa. So this will be like my <laughs> commitment, okay, my commitment untuk show up on Facebook at 10 a.m. in the morning. 10 a.m. because that is my um, most uh, flexible time. So if you are not able to join the live session, you can always rewatch back. But make sure you rewatch so that you don't miss out any important um, things that you can um, leverage to help build lah. Kan? So um, the Monday wisdom, the topics is already there. Cuma nya, um, maybe some days I will just swap the topic, uh, see whichever that's suitable for our um, our our needs, okay. So it, yang ini adalah dekat Facebook group lah, our M Oiler Academy group. And Wednesday product sharing fifteen minutes, okay. So um, this is not just about business, but we also have to be um, hunger for product knowledge. Sebab benda tu yang sebenarnya kita kena ada in order for us to share. Kan? And then business comes second because the product is the one that will touch people's life, not the business. Of course, the business part is very amazing, the income, you know. Tapi at the end of the day, we want to be selling ataupun to be promoting products that is working for other people. So, nak tak nak, we have to learn about products juga. Kan? So, products uh, sharing will be 15 minutes. Um, just 15 minutes. If you notice, memang I letak 15 minutes, I tak nak lama-lama because um, we are working, we have other commitment, commitments. Kan? So, it's just 15 minutes. And um, 15 minutes, it will be short and sweet. Just straight to the point, what is this, how to use it, you know, um, testimonies on whatever things that we can share. So, 
um, I will I will host the product sharing. And then if anyone here yang uh, berminat untuk uh, untuk contribute, untuk share your testimonials, you know, uh, untuk buat sharing, take kita macam uh, mic take over lah. Uh. So I want to take over your mic this Wednesday. Okay. Here you go. You you talk about the products or apa 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 yang you nak share. So you can go on on your Facebook page and then I will just share it share that video into our group. So that way you boleh um, cover your own audience and also you can uh, cover the group uh, our group members as well lah. Okay. So if you want to um, yang ni nanti I akan bagi a list kalau siapa-siapa yang nak fill in you want to get out from your comfort zone you want to you know start with a small group and start sharing um, you can do it okay with just 17 of us kalau you rasa malu-malu you tak berani nak cakap kat luar lagi so you can start with us nobody is going to judge you because we are all here to support each other okay so then we have the weekly task. The weekly task is every Monday, sorry, every Sunday, I will um, send up the new, the new, um, the new week punya task. So uh, of course, I'm not going to check everybody punya work. This is on you. You have the call whether how much you want to do it, berapa, berapa you nak buat, berapa yang you boleh buat, semua tu, it's all on you. Cumanya, um, the goal is always to grow. The goal is always to see you are ahead of where you were previously so that you nampak lah, you pun, okay, I am I am really growing, I am really seeing myself improving. That is our goal actually, okay. Um, lastly, stay connected. So we will communicate through WhatsApp group and also heavily on Facebook group. Heavily on Facebook group. Um, so if there's a, any um, Things that I learn from my side, I will share it in our Facebook group. If you have found any interesting things yang you belajar, contohnya macam, oh, I found one very interesting enrollment gives ideas you want to share. So you can share it in Facebook group, you can share it in WhatsApp group. So um, let's use this academy, this platform as some something that kita boleh start building habit of sharing if you are not the kind of like sharing every day. So, Hopefully, um, through these habits, it helps to build your um, your business habits, lah. Okay. Okay. So, lastly, is the Facebook group tour and Q and A. So, I am going to unmute everyone. If sorry, I'm not gonna unmute everyone. <laughs> Nanti ada pula terkeluar bunyi bunyi. So, if you have any question, uh, boleh unmute and um, tanya lah. Yes, question. Aisha. Cuma. <laughs> <laughs> tak ada question cuma nak nak kenal uh, team members lagi seorang kita punya uh, I mean Intan. boleh tak kita buat brief ha I mean semua orang lah kan kita dah ada group kan so macam nak kenal muka masing-masing and then boleh lah start at dekat Instagram and Facebook yes that's a good idea so maybe if um okay so uh, if anyone wants to come out and apa kita bagi uh, dalam beberapa masa beberapa minit untuk each other to like say hi and then like just say your name so that we see our faces lah sebab sebelum ni kita duduk dalam whatsapp kan ah. Ah, ah, kita kan ah, dah ada dekat dalam group yang kat dalam whatsapp tu dah susun tu kan so why ah. don't kita follow that that group so maksudnya macam kita first tip up kita bertiga so kita kenalkan diri kita and then next group uh, breathe again lepas tu heaven all kita follow this um, sequence boleh tak okay. ah boleh boleh okay kejap i tengok list tu jap okay okay so tips up first ah uh, me Yes, Aisha? I'm A, <laughs> Aisha, and Intan. Intan. Kak Intan. Oh, Kak Intan eh? Ha-ha. Uh -uh. Hai. Uh, Kak Intan, Intan tunjuklah dia. muka, Kak Intan. Ah, tak nampak. Kak Intan pun sabahan ke? Ya. Yeah. Oh, okay. Kak Intan compliant ke? Oh, sedang drive. Oh, tengah drive. Ya, yeah, oh. tengah drive. Oh, okay, okay. okay. It's okay lah. Uh, and then breathe again. Jiwa. 
Breathe yeah, again. Yeah. We have Bella. Hi, Bella. Hi. Tak nampak muka. Kejap, kejap. kejap. Okay. <laughs> This is the time where you have to grab whatever you have dekat you and then sarung. <laughs> okay, Bella. Sekejap, coming, coming. Yes. Oh. Ah, hi, Bella. Nah, lepas tu team dia, Askin. Okay. Hi. And Kak Ina. Yeah. Hi, Kak Ina. Okay, hi. next. Heaven Oil. Heaven oil. Okay. Hi, Alice. Ha, this is Alice. Yang satu di Singapura. I think yang oh is in Malaysia. I'm the only one in Malaysia. Yeah, we have, we have Alice from Singapore. Okay, wah. Macam Singapore. Running beauty pages. Sarawak. 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 Yeah. Sarawak, yeah. Oh. And then uh, Cecilia. Hello. Hi. I'm And then Celia. April. Okay. And then PNC oil. Susie. Hello, hi. Hi, Azwa. <laughs> Kichi, Kichi is not here, kan? Yeah, Kichi is not here. Okay. Uh, believe, we say, believe, Agnes. Hi. Hi. Priscilla. Priscilla is not, uh, Priscilla is here. La 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 la. Sila tengah busy kali. Okay, ni Monica ni ke? Um, Joy, Mal, eh mana pun sila. Hello. Mal dan Monica. Monica is tadi uh -huh. the best laughter. <laughs> Dia yeah, tu memang. In vision we have Anis and Rebecca. Hello. Za is here. Anis. Anis tunjuk muka. Tunjuk muka. Tunjuk muka sikit. Anis nampak profile je. Oh. Hi. Hi. Ha ah, ni Priscilla is here. Hi. Okay. Salala. Thank you so much. Oh, it's nice. Kalau every time kita buat Zoom, semua orang on video kan excited. Kan best. <laughs> okay. So, thank you so much for introducing yourself. Harap-harap uh, uh, lepas ni kita kenal lah muka eh. Kita kenal muka, kita nak kenal nama. Okay. So, let me share my uh, last session of the, just nak ajar uh, tunjuk korang macam mana kita guna the Facebook group lah because uh, mungkin tak semua familiar on how to use the Facebook group. So, this is the Facebook group. Uh, okay, so bila you click on the group, you will see um, if you are using laptop lah. Kan? If you are using mobile, then it's different. Uh, so, if you are using uh, desktop, okay. So, what you guys have to take note Okay, is this the guide? Dekat sini ada the guides. So dalam guides ni, um, this is like your step by step yang you can go through. So first is setting up accountability group. Okay, so if you have done that, um, you can click on done. Okay, so just to see where are you, you know, uh, di manakah kita berada dalam kita punya whole program ni. So set up accountability group. If you're done, you click on done. And then uh, master plan monthly tracker. So this is benda yang you boleh um, print out. Macam I cerita tadi tu, you print out and then you fill in whatever um, uh, that is relevant for you, the numbers, you know. Um, make it as something macam, it's a tracker. So uh, setiap seminggu tu, you you make sure you ada update tracker ni. So, so that you nampak, okay, I memang ada buat ni. So I am not like, not doing Uh, you know, miss out any, um, you know, sometimes we, kita rasa macam kita dah buat, tapi macam apa I buat lah, uh, macam tu kan. So, at least you see yourself, okay, I already took this, and last week I already accomplished this, and this week I'm going to focus on this, benda-benda uh, macam tu lah. So, there are three months of tracker, uh, tracker PDF files, and not PDF, uh, tracker files. 
uh, bulan Mei, Jun and Julai. So every month we'll print out different different trackers lah. But the content is actually the same, okay? And um, product Wednesday, I have yet to update this. So uh, later I will see if anyone wants to contribute, want to share and just, uh, you know, uh, give your topic. And then, um, then we can fill in the this, this column lah. So, and this is the weekly task. Okay, so this is the weekly task. So for week one, which is on 7th until 23rd of May, okay, um, this is the task that you have to complete. So this one is a bit small. Nanti I tukar the punya files, but this is actually a logo size. It's supposed to be a, a bigger file punya size lah. So nanti I will update and I will send it in a group. So these are the weekly tasks you have to do. Um, you can plan your own um, schedule, what you want to accomplish, what you want to, which one you want to do today, uh, nanti on Wednesday, which one you want to do. So you, this is your own flexibility. Um, so by the end of the week, I can uh, remind again on week two, week two punya task. So if you have done the task, uh, if not necessarily you can buat semua. Uh, because sometimes some mungkin tak relevant, some mungkin tak perlu, some mungkin bulan uh, minggu depan baru kita perlu perlu buat. So it might not be relevant to you. So just make sure you done like most of the things, can. Um, and then week three and week four, okay. So uh, we have only until week four, and then week five to eight nanti I akan update lagi in in this uh, column, okay. So this is the special guest appearance. So any, you know, if there is a special guest coming to share, I will update here. So you you guys akan nampak juga dekat our uh, main page lah. Apa-apa yang I update dekat sini, it will appear as the, as the uh, new activities here. So you akan nampak dekat sini lah. Okay. So, um, I'm, I, I will try to, you know, make this group as, fun as it can be. Uh, contohnya macam, you know, um, sometimes we come across some interesting, uh, interesting about essential oils ke, whatever things that you want to share, you can share it here juga. Okay. So, um, this is not my group. This is our group. So, if you have something to share, you can share it. If you want to share things from there to your, you know, like to back to your page, pun boleh juga. Um, so just my point is just to make this group as, um, you know, benda yang boleh memanfaatkan you in growing the business. Okay. So I think that's all for me. Um, so tomorrow we will have this on Monday wisdom. Okay. I forgot to talk about this. So Monday wisdom is setiap is name. I akan, sebenarnya I nak buat call, tapi I know call is not so um, easy lah, so we have to like hold the phone kan. Tapi benda ni you can just like working while like listening to me nagging there. So, um, and it's it's according to your time juga. Kalau you dah free and you tak free pada jam 10 pagi tu, you are free later, you can rewatch it. So the topics that I set up is here. Um, tomorrow, we'll talk about power of oils and affirmation. And then next Monday, we'll talk about um, top up your tank of knowledge and then setting goals and OGV mapping. And June, um, there will be four topics, um, more on um, business side. And then July is more on um, um, team and also management thing. Lah, okay. So um, every month, I, I hope that everyone can like tune in tomorrow at 10 because I think it's a bit sad. <laughs> If I if I like I show up at ten and then I don't see any viewers can I would I would lose my you know my excitement you guys because like nobody is listening so um I I'm sure you guys can understand kan bila kita go live kita macam duduk we wait for people to tune in oh my god where are these people nobody is watching my live and you okay tak apalah tutup it's it's kind of embarrassing sometimes kan so um if you are free and if you are um Ole, uh, you know, tune in Facebook for a while, 15 minutes, then uh, make it as a commitment, you know. Um, uh, I don't force that because I know some of you are working. So if you are able to, uh, just tune in at 10 a.m. every morning 
make it as macam uh, you know macam a reminder uh, 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 a good booster on to start your week lah something like that okay so i hope i hope by doing this um, because i am giving i'm going to give my focus on really this academy and i see you i see you guys as people who are willing to step up and um, really wanting to go that's why you sign up for this program kan so uh, of course i will focus on whoever wants to go uh, and my time on this academy it will be 60 70% of my time is is for this for this academy lah so i hope um, from here I hope that by the program me it helps like to build um it helps to build your business kalau you rasa dah you dah rasa stuck you rasa just stagnant you are not going anywhere you have been trying this and that but still not working maybe um you can give it a try to see if this system works for you so if you don't like me sharing about this talk uh, i mean if i suggest you to do this but you feel like this is not you it's okay then you can try something else um just don't don't be pressured yang oh i can buat ni sebab me cakap macam me i can buat ni sebab semua orang dah buat ni no it's not necessarily uh just make sure that if you have tried it and it doesn't if you don't like how it looks how it feels like you feel like this is not you then it's okay right if this is your business um it, it is your own business your legacy so you are free to what apa apa yang you nak for your business okay so i think that's all from me um overrun a bit 12 minutes next time i'll do better okay one hour sharp uh thank you so much for joining everyone uh i really appreciate your attendance hari ni um if there is no any questions any questions from you guys tak ada me thank you Okay, thank you so much. So I'll see you guys tomorrow at 10 a.m. in the Facebook Live. Okay. Uh, recording ni, um, I have to upload somewhere. So I tak boleh nak stream tadi. So I upload somewhere and then I share in Facebook group lah. So we can rewatch it. Okay. So thank you so much. Happy okay, Sunday. You. Bye. Assalamualaikum. Have a nice day. Bye.